this here that I'm going to be waiting to turn into the shop. Uh, this is one of our large ball valves, uh, actually it's a small ball valve that we're going to be broaching. Uh, the operator is setting it into our pot fixture and he's going to, in a moment, get everything uh, set and aligned and square to the teeth on the broach. so we utilize some uh, air hoist to help us move everything around. And now he's leveling the parts to position it correctly to the cutting teeth of the tool. The cutting on this tool is, uh, the rise per tooth is very light and it's designed to not shatter and bounce and move around. insert the broach into the parts and flip it up into the pull end of the machine. So he's brought it home. We'll do another check for alignment. got our cutting fluid going on here and this entire broaching process is going to be very fast. And here we go. It's very quiet, very smooth cut. And that's broaching. Now we just produced a 27 tube in the loose spline through about a 3 inch length of cut uh, in under 10 seconds. Remove the part, clean it up, and box it, and we're shipping them out of here with the rest of them. We, would, we could do anywhere between you know, 50 and 100 of these a day without a problem. Uh, more than that, the volumes on these are relatively small. They're expensive parts for them to fabricate, so... We typically get them in, in in size ranges of you know 20 to 25 at a time. Uh, we've got a half run right now, uh, but this is again one of the smaller ones. Some of them that we do are you know 48 and 60 inches in diameter. These this is the small one. 